Ah, uh, my bad. Oh, I'll take it. What is this? Hmm. Okay, so we need to find those items. Still, we need to figure out how to uh, how do I run? Oh. Oops. I suppose it's okay. Oh, yes. <clears throat> Here goes my neighbor's dogs again. Who's the? How the hell do I? Uh... Do I run? Okay, so I guess I cannot run. In the in this game the main character cannot doesn't know how to run. <laughs> Lovely. It's gonna take a while. Hmm? Is it? Nope. Oh, I just looking out. I suppose I could kill it. Just so I could obtain some more uh, XP and items. Hmm? What the fuck was that? Oh shit, it's a scorpion! <laughs> Holy shit, that was awesome. Fuck, there's nothing in the scorpion. That was a waste of time. Hmm? Oh, you guys. Oh, I remember you. Come on, clearly shooting you guys. There you go, did it. Can you give me anything? Thank you. Take it. Whoops. And where's the other one? Oh, there right, you are, fucker. Me. Nice. What, is there something here? Oh wait, is this the place where, where I was buried? Oh, fuck.
And that's where is Orasole. We are gonna find him and kill him. There you go. You're done for. Hmm. Really? Jesus Christ. Okay, so where is it? In here? Where the fuck is the item I need? Oh, this thing. I could barely see it. I believe that the mantas here are dangerous. They look so innocent. Not dangerous at all, but I guess they are. What's up? I am back. I think this is it. No, it's not. <laughs> My mistake. Where the fuck am I supposed to go?
Okay, so this is what you want me to get. Alright, I'm on it. You want some? Bring it! Sorry doggy, you chose that and I'm giving it to you. Oh wait, never mind. You guys are not... <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, that is fucked up. I love it. Yo, Sunny, <laughs> what's up? You'll never know. Guess what? Know what I did? I just decapitated a coyote with my gun, with bullet. Let me see what you got. It was fucking awesome. Yeah, these will do just fine. Just fine. All right, now. We're going to be making something folks on the trail call healing powder. Go on over to that campfire now. Give All it a try. Right. I thought we were going to make some food, but fuck it. I guess we're gonna do some healing powder. Hey, that's not bad, see? All it takes to make a recipe is the right ingredients and the right know-how. Sometimes it won't be a campfire you need. Might need to do some work on your guns and ammo, maybe. Important thing to get is it's all the same idea. You just need to find the right place to set up shop. Workbench or reloading bench, whatever. Well, I hope that's enough to get you started. I'm it is back a start. Now. Hope I didn't miss anything good on the jukebox. Cheyenne would never forgive me. Hey, do me a favor. Right. Trudy, she's the bartender up at the Prospector. Kind of the town mom. She likes to meet newcomers. She'd be cross with me if I didn't ask you to poke your head in and say hi. I guess I'll do that. Guess I'll do just that. Ah, still pissing messed up. Oh well.
Hmm. Am I going the right direction? I guess I am. Okay, here we go. Back to this place. Oops. I'm done being nice. If you don't hand Ringo over soon, I'm going to get my friends and we're burning this town to the ground. Got it? We'll keep that in mind. Now, if you're not going to buy something, get out. I'm going to remember you, bitch. What's up? Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally got to meet you. Welcome to the Prospector Saloon. What did I do? Looks like our little town got itself dragged into the middle of something we don't want anything to do with. About a week oh, ago, lovely. this traitor, Ringo, comes into town. Survivor of an attack, he says. Bad men after him. Needs a place to hide. We figured he was just in shock. So we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't actually expect anyone to come after him. Um. He's holed up at the abandoned gas station up the hill. Some of the others, like Sonny, will probably stand up for Ringo if he asks for help, which he hasn't. Personally, I hope he sneaks out of town one night and takes the powder gangers with him. Chain gangs, really. The NCR brought them in from California to work on the rail lines. Problem is, it turns out that giving convicts a bunch of dynamite and blasting powder isn't the best idea. It was a big escape would've, not too long ago. Expected Some that. of them stuck together so they could make well, trouble. That's what we're dealing with now. I can already tell one thing. Not a fan of NCR if they're just gonna do stupid decisions like that. Hmm. Alright. If you were able to get Ringo out of this mess, you'd have a decent reputation around Good Springs. I'd even set you up with a discount. Ooh. Of course, helping Ringo would also make the powder gangers mad. And they've got a lot of friends out there. Well, I do require some XP. I just started this adventure, so... Not much, other than there are a bunch of freeloaders who expected a few rounds on the house. I was able to get them to pay up, though. Of course, one of the great cons did knock my radio to the floor by accident. And it hasn't by been accident, working since. Eh? They were having some kind of argument about it, but the guy in the checkered coat kept shushing them. It sounded like they came in from the north through Quarry Junction. If that's the case, I can't say I blame them for not wanting to go back. Hmm. Go on. That whole area is overrun with the kind of critters that just get mad if you shoot them. Merchants avoid that whole stretch of I-15 like it's radioactive, which it could be for all I know. I didn't hear exactly, but the leader was talking about the strip. The if fellow strip? wants to get there and avoid the 15, he'd have to go east. Take Highway 93 up. Okay, I see. I know that thing as much as anyone else around here. It mostly keeps to itself, which is just fine by me. Hmm. It acts friendly enough, but I don't trust that whole cheerful cowboy act. I find it all very creepy. Is that so? It was here when I took over the saloon seven years ago. Some people have said its owner lived here, but no one knows who it was. Other than rolling around once in a while, it doesn't do anything useful as far as I can tell. I don't know why it took an interest in you, but I'd be careful. It's never helped anyone before. That does sound suspicious. Fine by me. Mostly traders looking to buy bighorn or meat and hides. The traders are the main reason the general store manages to stay in business. Most travelers heading south on the I-15 just push on towards Prim, unless they're in desperate need of supplies. I see. 
There's always something interesting going on. But the biggest news has to be the coming dust up between the NCR and the Legion over the dam. The dam? Are you going to say anything else? Sure, the outside looks okay, but I think something broke on the inside. There'd be caps in it for you. I do like to hear what's going on in the world. And that Mr. New Vegas seems like such a gentleman. You don't say. Oh yeah, tell me about NCR. The New California Republic's got the most power in Nevada. Money, troops, you name it. They do what they can to keep things safe in the region. But if you ask me, they're trying to do too much. They're spread too thin. So they suck. Probably. Slavers, killers, and all other kinds of trouble. They dress up like Roman soldiers, so there's no mistake in it when you see them. The rumor is, is that the Legion is far larger than the NCR lets on, and that it's been due to luck that the Legion hasn't overrun the territory. Due to luck, eh? Well, my luck is extremely high, so... I'm pretty sure the NCR wants to hold on to the dam because it's one of the few places around that can make electricity. The Legion are a bunch of sense. savages, though. No idea why they'd want the dam. Probably plan on destroying it or something. Hmm. So far, it doesn't seem like Be I want... Out there. Like, I don't want anything to do with either of them. One group is uh, slave owners and killers, and the other one... Well, I'm, I'm also going to become a killer, but putting that aside... On the other hand, there's a group of people calling themselves NCR who apparently suck at bringing order. Lovely. I got so many options. Okay, let's go and try to help this uh, Ringo guy, mainly because I want the money. Hmm? Oh, so that doing this I get to wait. That's good to know. Alright, here we go. That's the that's the place. Ooh. I'm not gonna buy it. How the fuck do I get in? Okay, there was a door here. <laughs> it's totally gone. Hmm. Alright, how the fuck do I get in? Oh. <gasps> Through the door, of course. Hold on.
Okay, and I'm back. I got in. Let's try this. Go again. That's close enough. What's up? Who are you, and what do you want with me? Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard, that's all. We got off to a bad start. What say we start over with a friendly game of caravan? You know um, how to play? Um... Yeah. He doesn't look very tough, though. I hear he's afraid I'll shoot him down from one of the windows when I see him. And he's right. I'll have a much bigger problem once his friends show up. There's no way I could handle all of them in a gunfight. Well... I'm gonna lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I've got no chance against the gang on my own. Yes, maybe I can help. All I've got left on me are a handful of caps, but you get me out of this and I'll make sure the Crimson Caravan pays you back. You've got my word. We'd just end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two of us. Now, if some of the other people in town were also on board... Hmm. Start with Sunny Smiles. She's been friendlier than most around here. Alright then. So, that's our plan, I guess. I'm gonna somehow help her. This guy get into hell out of here. Alright, Sunny, where the fuck are you? I require your help. Are you in there? Nope. I am not. <laughs> I'm not gonna do anything of that in there. Oh, is it here? Oh, there you are. Hi. What's up? Hi there. Sticking around Good Springs for a while longer? Yeah, I'm trying to. Uh... <laughs> yes, I'm going to help Ringo. Say no more. I'm in. Oh, fuck yeah. <laughs> well, that was easy. Joe Cobb talks about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo. But I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. If you could convince Trudy to join us, some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. I know oh. Easy Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere. And Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. A silver tongue would help. Convincing Trudy that we had a good plan to win the fight would also help. I don't think give is in Chet's vocabulary. Even with the town at stake, he'd still make you barter with him. Hmm... Easy Pete's pretty protective of his dynamite. You'd have to convince him you know a thing or two about explosives before you handed it over. Well... My conversation skills are not the greatest. I'll be waiting. So you're planning on taking on Joe Cobb's gang. It's a big risk, but I suppose you have to do what you think is right. I don't have enough of speech. That does sound like a good plan. Alright, you seem to know what you're doing, so you can count me in. Oh, Let me thank have God. a word with a few other folks, and I'll see if I can't round up some more members for this militia you're creating. While Perfect. everyone does own a gun, we could stand to be a little better equipped. A general store probably has what we need in stock. Be careful. Ooh. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna increase this. I'm definitely gonna need it. That and 
explosions. Fuck yeah. Okay. So let me see. Uh, I guess I'll go for this one. This one? Oh yeah, fuck it, I'm gonna go for this one. Definitely gonna need it. All right, are hey. you? Howdy. What can Easy Pete do for you? Too dangerous. Want to kill all yourselves if I let you touch it. Better to leave it buried. Safer that way. Good. Fuck. Explosions are not enough. Yup. The one in the fantasy. Word of advice, though. If you ever catch up with him, watch out. The man's got cold eyes like a snake. Can't be trusted, I'd say. Don't worry, I got this. Keep your... That looks like I fell with the ham. Maybe I'll figure it out eventually. Hmm. I think I'm gonna have to increase my explosions ability. I said it would wait to say it. Let me see. Yo, Doc! <laughs> we need your help. Where the fuck are you? Oh, there you are. Why the hell are you just standing there? Okay. Welcome back. I had hoped you wouldn't need to come see me again so soon. What can I do for you? Well, about that. Seems like wherever I go, it's always the same. Folks just never leave each other alone. Oh, I'm not much good in a fight with my bum leg. And my supplies are scarce. But I'll give you what I can spare. Mm -hmm. You take care now. Okay, there you go. Let me see. How long until I uh, level up again? Is there any way for me to tell? Okay, I'm currently level 2, but I'm going to 